What's up guys, Cryptic Crazy here, and today I'm bringing you guys a the Slums gameplay on... Securing C. Oh, I messed that up. A gameplay on Slums and Domination. Um, We've taken control. So, today I have a few things I want to talk about. First, I think I finally got my settings right, so you guys can finally hear me. That's why I haven't uploaded down, in the past couple by. days. Because I've been trying to figure out He's the out. settings and I can't figure them out. I think I finally figured it out. So, Dropped uh, second, we have two new leaders. Uh, I promoted to. Uh, first off, I would like to congratulate these people. I promoted uh, Madness and Visions, or Gino and Nate, to leaders. They are now officially leaders of Cryptic once again. They were. When we were back in plane, and then when we decided to change the name to Cryptic, we decided we would uh, back down to one leader, and that would be me because I'm the owner. Um, but today, I figured I would, uh, I would uh, promote them just because you know they do a lot for the clan. Nate makes all the graphics, and Gino, freaking Rex, and competitive and carries the team half the time. So. He, really, he deserves it. Both of them do. Um, Nate made the emblems. He's gonna make my intro for me. He, he made the he edits the website for us. He does so much. He helps me with my render settings. He, he helps me with so much, and he really deserves this. And I hope they enjoy it. Uh, it's actually a surprise to them. Uh, they don't know it yet. That this is how they're finding out. I, I'm gonna tell them to watch this video and watch it all the way through. <coughs> But, yeah, so that's really cool for them. I really hope they enjoy it. Uh, they really deserve it. Second thought, uh, first off, I made a clan Instagram. Uh, like, wanted to talk about gaming and stuff. Well, post about them. Um, it's cryptic underscore crazy. No capitals, you know, Instagram doesn't do capitals and news and stuff. Um, you'll find me, it says in my bio crazy, and it's just one out of three leaders, or something like that. Third, uh, I'm gonna change my outro, you guys will notice that at the end of the video. So I'm not gonna be saying it as fast, uh, in, uh, like while I'm still working on it, while I'm still getting used to it, but hopefully I can fix it and, uh, be able to say it as fast as I used to be. And uh, another thing, the reason I'm changing is because we don't really work with Giga K videos anymore. Uh, so we're not going to like tell you guys to check him out at the end of the, every video we post. Because it's really not fair because he never really helped us out so why should we help him out? That's another that, that kind of thing. Like don't get me wrong, I'm going to help out people in the community uh, who are just getting started. Um, but we asked to him to sub for sub for us. Which he did. We asked him to shout us out in a couple of his videos. He never did that. Reloading. Put our link in the description. Never did that. He... Down. Which we didn't take too time to. Uh, and we up. haven't talked to him since... God, I think since July of 2013, so... It's been a while, and... Uh, yeah, and we're also not gonna work with Barrel Lord. We never really did. We posted one video with him. Uh, and we haven't worked with him since, and uh, we don't plan to. Him and Gino don't really get along, which I understand. Gino has his beliefs, and he doesn't support gay rights. Uh, but that's on him. Uh, that's not my issue. I don't really. As long as he doesn't say anything on the channel about hating Barrel Lord like he actually does, then yeah, he's fine. So. That's really it for that. Um, trying to think. I had a couple of things I wanted to talk about. Um, let me think. It's too close. Fight harder. Gotta kill. Um. Friendly lightning strike inbound.
Oh man. Sorry guys, I don't mean to go silent on you guys. I'm seriously trying to think of something. Um, I guess I can talk about competitive for a little bit. So right now, as as it stands today, the competitive team is me, Gino, Chance, and Nick, or uh, me, Visions, Swerve, and uh, Cobra. That's not in order. Chance is Cobra, Nick Secure is Swerve, Gino's Visions, and I'm crazy, obviously. Securing a. Um, and we are in love with that team. It's really good. <clears throat> Uh, Swerve, you guys might recognize that name. We brought him back from being on the competitive team. He used to be on it in Black Ops 2. Uh, we dropped him for Cobra, actually. And uh, now they're a teammate. Since Pat retired, we picked up Style. Style, Style left the clan, and then he asked us. Or then we asked him to lead Cryptic South since he doesn't want to be my teammate, and he was looking for a clan. So he agreed to do that. So he's the leader of Cryptic South now, which is, I'm still the leader of the clan, he's just the captain of Cryptic South, he can decide who's on it. And I, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna tell him he can't have somebody on his team. I don't really like Cryptic Apex, um, but he's allowed to be on the team as long as he doesn't disrespect me while he's in the clan. Um, and that was our agreement. He said he's going to sit him down and talk. Well, he knows I'm in Rush, so he's going to sit him down and talk to him about that and uh, about how I'm the owner, how I can kick him just like as easy as I can kick a soccer ball or as easy as I can. Like, I can kick him just like that. Like, by the time you're done watching this video, he could be out of the clan. Now I'm not gonna kick him unless he uh, honestly unless he does anything to me I'm gonna I'm not gonna kick him um, and that doesn't mean like trash talking when we're scrimming against cryptic South. that just means when we're playing friendly and he's trash talking talks just me that's not acceptable that's not how that's not how cryptic is run. That's not what we want our members to be. We want our members to be represented. Or we want us to be represented as a well, uh, as a clan with a really good attitude. We don't want to be known as cocky. We don't want to be known as the people who are are like really good or are not really good and they act like really good, kind of like Vixa. Um and. We don't want to act, like, really cocky. The only reason we say stuff about Vixa is because we've beaten them 30 times and we could easily beat them again. Uh, they beat us once. We beat them, let's see, I think we're at 37 now? 38? Something like that. Um, they ended our 23 win streak on the, uh, about a month or so ago. Then we are back on a 17. <coughs> So, not 17, 16. So, yeah, 39, we're at. So, that's how our team is. Now, don't get me wrong, they probably are skilled in some certain things, life wise. But, uh, the only really good player they have is their supposed worst players uh, in Vixa skills. Taze and Rampage, or Chaos, whatever his name is now. They say uh, that they're the best. They never agree. And see, in our screen, when we're playing, we all agree that Visions is the best. Everybody in the clan does. Um, and Visions, he even says he's the best, but he tries. Like sometimes, but he tries to live it down. He tries to say, "Oh, I'm not that good. Uh, I'm not all that. I'm not everything." And that's why we like Visions on the team. He's a really good team player. He's really good for our competitive team. He's very good. He's extremely, extremely, has a great attitude. He gets pumped up. He gets excited. And that's what we look for in them. But anyway, guys, this gameplay is coming to an end. Um, comment, like, subscribe, follow us on Twitter. It'll be down in the description below. As always, guys, this is Cryptic Crazy, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Thanks, you, thank you guys so much for watching.